good morning. So last week we went over the rules of how to play in golf. And today we're actually going to get familiar with holding a golf club and also strike a golf ball for a fixed distance. We're gonna practice in stations. And after we're done with our stations, we're gonna play a game called Frisbee Golf. But before we do all of that, we first wanna get warmed up. So can I have everyone please be lined up, arm distance apart, and let's begin our warm up. Ready, begin. Station. So for the first station, we're going to focus on aiming straight, but for a fixed distance. As you can see, I have a line full of cans here. Each can is going to represent a hole. So this is hole number one, this is hole number two, and this is hole number three right over here. My goal, okay, is to try to hit each can within three tries. So my starting point will be right over here. If we have this can laying down, and I have three tries to hit the first can. Let's say, for example, I miss on the first try, right? Then on the second try, okay, set the starting point. On the second try, I actually hit it. Well, once I hit my can, I'm gonna place it behind the starting point, which is right over here. I'm gonna get my golf ball, place it at the starting point, and I'm gonna get ready to hit the next can after that. Now notice how the distance is increasing once I take away each can, all right? Let's say for the next can, I miss in all three tries, right? I miss on the first try, the second try, and the third try. Well, I still need to do the same thing. I need to get, I need to get the can, place it behind the starting point, and then get ready to hit the last can, all right? Once I'm done hitting each can, your partner's gonna give you a score, so we're gonna work in partners. So while you're doing this, your partner's gonna keep score of how many times you're able to hit each can, the least amount of times. All right, once you're done, they'll give you a score and it's gonna be your turn to give the score for them. All right, now to hit the basics to hit each can, all right? You wanna make sure that your feet are shoulder width apart, okay? Make sure your chest is up, make sure your back is not slouching, your back is straight, and you want, you're holding the golf club with both hands, okay? Not just, not one hand, but both hands, all right? This is just a basic idea. So we hit it for, hit it for both hands. Now, if I see that the can is not too far apart, I'm not gonna use too much power. I'm gonna swing maybe midway to hit the golf ball straight towards the can. You don't wanna aim at an angle like this, not too inside and not too far apart where it's not gonna hit the can, okay? You wanna aim as straight as possible towards the can and follow through afterwards, all right? So it's gonna be for station number one. For station number two, it's gonna be the same concept. Except this time, each can is going to be a starting point, all right? So, for example, let's say I start at can number one. It's going to take me three tries, right? I have three tries to hit can number two. This is can number three, and that's can number four. So, let's say, for example, for can number two, I hit it on the second try. Once I hit the can the second try, I'm going to place the can again, and that's going to be my new starting point to hit can number three. Let's say for can number three, I'm missing all three tries. Well... You still have to go to can number three and continue until you finish the whole station. So then from can number three, you're gonna hit can number four. And once you're done with can number four, your partner again will give you a score, all right? Once your, your partner is done giving you a score, then it's gonna be their turn to participate in the station and it's gonna be your job now to keep score for them. Once we're done with all the stations, all right, we're gonna compare scores. We're gonna give each other feedback on our performances, all right? And give each other some tips on where what areas we can improve whether it's our stance whether it's how we sp uh, how, it's how we uh, swing right but all of this is going to prepare you for the next class session why because for the next class session we're going to focus a little a little bit more in technique we're going to get more into detail on how to actually swing how to how to place your stance right all right but for today just get familiar with uh with the stance and holding the golf club and swinging okay other than that if you have any questions, I'll be walking around, making sure everyone participates. Also, at each station, there's gonna be a task card. So if you're confused on exactly what needs to be done, just look at the task card, okay? It's gonna tell you exactly, you know, what the, the job for the person that's gonna keep score and for the person that's gonna participate in the station, okay? Other than that, you may begin. We can now focus on a game called Frisbee Golf. So for Frisbee Golf, we actually, went over the unit of frisbee so we know exactly how to play in frisbee right 
Well, for Frisbee golf, it's gonna be the same thing, except this time we're gonna be using a golf club and a golf ball. Now for the golf ball, it's gonna be really heavy, so it could hurt someone, so we're gonna use a much lighter ball. All right, but the concept for the game is gonna be the same thing as if you play in Frisbee. The only difference uh, in this game is that I'm gonna use cans, okay? Two cans on opposite sides of the field, all right? And each team is gonna be responsible for hitting the can for a point, okay? The team with the most points wins the match, all right? So we have 24 students in the class, so I'm gonna have two matches. So I'm gonna have six against six. Another match is gonna be six against six. And then we'll have a championship game. And then after that, we'll be done with the lesson, okay? If you have any questions, you could ask me. I'll be walking around making sure, again, everyone participates. Other than that, let's begin our games. Ready, begin. So now we're done with our game. Please bring it in. Please bring all the equipment in. Please form half a circle in front of me and take a seat. All right, I saw a lot of improvement from everyone. Everyone did an amazing job. We were all competing out there. We were all getting familiar with how to hold a golf club, how to strike a golf ball. So we did a great job. For the, for the next class session, we're gonna get actually more into technique on how to actually swing, right, for distance. But today, we're just to get familiar with holding a golf club, okay, and striking a golf ball. If you have any questions, please stay at the class about the lesson. Other than that, class is dismissed. Thank you.